it's the next day, 31st, and we are heading out to Hosawa Falls to see if we can find a cache. And actually, the buses are extremely rare here, so we're taking a taxi. But hey, that's life, it's part of the process. Let's, let's take a look and see where we're heading into the mountains. Well, it cost us 3,000 yen by taxi to get up to this area. And now, we have to walk. The hints say that the GPS doesn't work well in this area. And you can see why. It's all surrounded by mountains. But I am so freaking glad that we are out of the city. You can't believe it. So, it's definitely worth it. And it's cool here today. Definitely cool. I'm wearing a toque and mitts, and we're trekking along. Ooh, look! No, that's not Hosawa Falls. But that would be a cool place to go swimming in the summer. Ooh, let's keep going. We're moving up there. The taxi dropped us off. It said, <clears throat> the uh, GPS said 173 meters. I got excited. But then I realized it's like 173 meters as the crow flies over that mountain. So we have to go around the mountain, which means we're on this trail. Wow, you'd almost think we're in the country. Huh. Wait a minute. We are in the country. Hiroko, how are your new shoes? Nice? Good. She looks nice, too. Whoa, how is this for a discovery? A frozen waterfall. We are at Hinohara Falls. And now we have to find the cache. I wonder where it could be hidden. We have to look around and take an adventure. Let's climb up to where Hiroko is up there. Look at this, the little pond is even frozen. So you get an idea what the temperature is like here. This is cool. Well, we got it. Fantastic spot, great location. I put a nice big electronics travel bug in there. And when we get back into some civilization, because the GPS doesn't work here, we will record the find and put up a picture and everything like that. This is really a great spot. I'm so glad I came out here because work is driving me crazy. 